Welcome to a taste of Miami Beach like no other. We've got the inside scoop on an iconic dining experience at Joe's Stone Crab. From valet to the crab itself, and all the unforgettable moments in between. As you pull up to Joe's, the excitement begins. Valet takes care of your ride, setting the stage for a night of indulgence. The warm Miami breeze greets you, and you're ready to step into a world of culinary delight. And as you step inside, you're greeted by the friendly doorman, setting the tone for a night to remember. Walk on by the bustling bar, where the energy is contagious, and the excitement builds. Uh, two for Jim. Eight o'clock. G E R. Ah, but here comes the plot twist. The slick Major D drops a bombshell. Excuse me. Jim, do you have a confirmation on your phone? Your reservation isn't official because you didn't get an email confirmation. What a curveball. You might have thought he drew the short straw when it comes to seating. Do you think this is the best table in the restaurant? No. But don't fret. Sometimes the best surprises happen in the most unexpected places. And there's no denying it. This place is buzzing with history. Meet George or Yogi, your waiter for the evening. These guys are the real stars of the show, making every moment memorable. Oh, but let's not forget the unbelievable bread basket. It's like a carb lover's dream come true. Fine, thank you. Oh, what do we got here? This looks great, man. Wow, that looks real. <laughs> My name is George, by the way, but they call me Yogi over here. Hey, Yogi. Okay. Oh, this bread looks amazing. I don't know where to start. They've, it's like they reinvented bread. So this is like a corn muffin? That looks, look at this is like a, these are called. Michelangelo, for the pain of this. Oh, that's a crack. Really? And the pretzel bread. Okay, I what, got you got a pretzel? Wow. Okay, you got to do it with the You like to store them. The crackers could taste so good. So, this is an ordinary cracker. It's delicious, huh, Jimmy? Let's, let's see what's going on with this cracker. The cracker is pretty good, Jimmy. So, what's going on with pretzel bread? It's very good. And this is like... A pretzel or is it a bread? Oh, it tastes like a pretzel. It's a pretzel. Joe's is famous for their mouth-watering $8.95 chicken. And it's a showstopper. Let me tell you. So what's your favorite? <laughs> Stone crab for sure. King crab legs. We have three different variations. These are the golden. We have red legs and also red palms. All are a pound and a half per order. They just vary in pricing and portion. Wow. Now what about like the um, mahi? I love that with bolts on. Okay. And what do you mean by that? That's sounding pretty good. Right. So, you know, but it comes with no sides, right? That no, one. This I was one, just garnished with the sauce on the plate. And the two shrimp. Okay. You have to order your sides. They bring them to the table as a group, yeah. And how are the um, hash browns? Those cooked in, oil, in a hash iron skillet. Oil, um, oil straight crunchy on the bottom and the top. Yeah, the top. Are you going to get ketchup with that? <laughs> the small one's good for both. What's that? The small one's good for two people. Oh, okay. And lionies is just a sauteed onion on top. I really recommend that. Okay. Oh, so it's the same thing. What are you getting? I, you know what? I can see Kevin right now. Uh, we're talking about the side dishes? Yeah, I want to get those um, hash browns. Let's get, yeah, let's get it with the onions. Okay, and what would be another one that's not broccoli? What's something fun? I mean, I'm coming to like... Grilled tomatoes. Grilled tomatoes. It's grilled tomatoes. Have you had those before? I have not had grilled tomatoes. You slice beef steak tomato okay. with a spinach stuffing mm -hmm. and then topped with American cheddar. The drinks? Oh, they are simply spectacular. Joe's knows how to mix a drink to perfection. Sip and savor. You're in for a treat. Okay, um, one other question too. A lot of tourists come in this place. What's the number one tourist drink at Joe's Stone Crab? 
at the bar. The Joe's Mule or the Key Lime Martini? <laughs> oh, okay. I'm going to try the Key Lime Martini. Do you have like a, anything else with a Key Lime? I don't know if you're going to Oh, no. Well, it's called Key Lime Pie. We have a cucumber cooler. Okay, so you're going to go with the Key Lime yeah. Martini. Yeah. It's right off the bat. It looks beautiful. Oh, guys. So now I'm going to try the key lime martini here at Joe's Stone Crab. It's good. It tastes like a key lime pie. And it even has like the graham around the top. Graham cracker crust. Look at that. It's good. It's a Publix key lime pie, but you can drink it. You sound like you like it. It is good. Okay. Can I have ketchup with my potatoes? That's a big issue. <laughs> Jim, I think you're going to have enough food. You think so? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Those potatoes. Oh, this is great. Yes, please. Uh -huh. Yes, uh-huh. Thank you. Oh, wow. The food looks amazing. Oh, the mahi looks good. Thank you. I feel like I'm in Frankie move. So, this chicken is like nine bucks. Eight ninety-five, Jim. Keep the same prices, not adjusted for inflation. One person said that they don't. They have not changed the price. Wow. I hope it's good. One of the specialties is grilled tomatoes. Let's try that. Guess what? Like your parmesan tomatoes? I'm not even going to eat it. Do you want mine? Yeah, I'll eat it. Okay. It's not very tasty, not worth the points. It's okay. Now, your fish looks beautiful. Yeah. It's almost like sculpture. Yeah. And it gave you some shrimp, too. And it's a. It looks like an unusual color sauce. Yeah, it's, it's a Oh, that is really good. So you love the mahi? Oh, yeah. Tell me about the sauce. It's kind of like spicy. It's like a gumbo. Like a gumbo. Okay, interesting. Thank you. Jim, I think you're going to have the rest of your hamburger. You like the chicken? Oh, yeah. How is it compared to Colonel Sanders? Different? You're into your fish. I have to try that too. Oh, yeah. So the tomatoes were kind of a little bit ordinary and they use like American cheese. So now I'm going to try this chicken. For not bucks, it's pretty good chicken. I like it. Well, there was a ton of food, well prepared, tasty. I like this place, but our table was kind of lacking. So whether you're local or passing through Joe's Stone Crab is a Miami Beach institution you can't miss. From filet to crab and all the surprises in between, it's an experience that will leave you craving more. Come on down and let Joe's make your trip unforgettable. If you like this video, hit like, subscribe, and comment. Thompson.